watching SEC Network football presented by Allstate as Georgia Tech with 13 seconds to go first down and 10 but a long way to go. Can they pick up enough to get into field goal range. This takes one big play and to get out of bounds. Thomas, he's going to try to run, has the first down. Now we'll get out of bounds, and there are five seconds left. Make it four, 21-yard well, pickup on the play. Now you really have to emphasize to Justin Thomas that if it's going to be a one-play deal, I think Paul Johnson may be thinking about taking a field goal attempt right now. Yeah, don't mess around with it and trying to drop back and get a get a playoff real quick. It's actually four seconds left. They're going to try the field goal attempt right now. 53 yards. He has missed from 51 time this year. His long on the year is 46. And Mark Rick going to make him think about it a little bit longer. Butker earlier today had one blocked by Ray Drew. That was from 37 yards away. Harrison missed from 52 against Duke earlier this year. This one will be from 53. Nice scramble by Thomas to pick up the yardage to at least let him get in some field goal range. Yeah. Well, Johnson has a lot of confidence in Harrison Butker. And he feels like, you know, he, he was going to have an All-American type season this year. But 10 of 16 coming in. He's had one block today. He could fix all that right now with a 53-yarder for Georgia Tech to send it into overtime. Here we go. The crowd will tell you the story. Butker the snap was perfect the hold was perfect and he nails it right down the gut to send it to overtime oh my takes three components the snap the hole and the kick all three work in sync it is right down the middle and long enough Just enough. <laughs> that would have been good from 53 and a half. <laughs> and oh we're boy. about to see the first overtime game in the history of Sanford Stadium. Well, it's appropriate. They went to double overtime a year ago. In we, Atlanta, GA. Yeah, we talked about just how evenly matched both these two teams were coming in both in the top 15 and both 